everybody. It's Miss Jane from the Burlington Public Library. Good morning, everyone. And I'm Miss Jen, and I'm really excited to be here. We're going to start doing uh, mini story times on Wednesdays at 10 o'clock uh, virtually, so we hope you join us. Let's start just like we do story time as we clap and sing hello. Ready? We clap and sing hello. We clap and sing hello. With our friends of story time, we clap and sing hello. Let's tap. We tap and sing hello. We tap and sing hello. With our friends of story time, we tap and sing hello. Let's wave. We wave and sing hello. We wave and sing hello. With our friends of story time, we wave and sing hello. Hi, friends. All right, we're going to try a new song today about washing our hands. So have you been washing your hands, Ms. All Jen? the time, <laughs> several times a day. <laughs> Me too. So let's put our hands up, and it goes like this. Tops and bottoms, tops and bottoms, in between, in between. Rub them all together. Rub them all together, squeaky clean, squeaky clean. Good job. Make sure you're really washing your hands. It's so important to keep us healthy. All right, we have a story for you today about Dog and his colorful day. And this book is actually based on a book written by Emma Dodd. So Miss Jen's going to do the flannel part while I read. Here we go. This is Dog. As you can see, Dog is white with one black spot on his left ear. At breakfast time, Dog sits under the table as usual. Splat! A drip of red jam lands on his back. There it is. Now Dog has two, two dots. dots. After breakfast, Dog runs outside. He slips past the man painting the front door. Splish! His tail dips into the blue paint. Oh no! There you go. Now Dog has three spots. Should we count? One, two, three. Dog runs to the park and rolls on the grass. Squash! The grass makes a green stain on his white coat. Now dog has one, two, three, four. Four spots. Dog follows a little boy eating chocolate. Squish! The boy gives dog a chocolatey pat, but no chocolate to eat. Now dog has how many spots? One, two, three, Four, five, five. A bee buzzes up to see what's going on. Swish! The bee drops yellow pollen as it flies by. Now dog has one, two, three, four, five, six. Six, six spots. Dog trots on through the park. Splash! A drop of pink ice cream lands on his right ear. Oh, right there. Now he has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven spots. <gasps> Time to go home. Dog runs up the street. Splash! A bouncing ball splatters dog with gray mud. Now dog has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight spots. spots. In front of the gate, Dog steps on a carton of orange juice. Splurt! A patch of orange appears on his leg. Right there. Now Dog has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine spots. Dog races back inside the house and knocks right into Vicky. Silly dog. V 
Vicky's purple marker leaves a smudge on dog's head. On his head. There we go. <laughs> now dog has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Ten, ten spots. Vicky looks down at dog. She counts his colorful spots. <gasps> Vicky looks more closely. Look at all those colors. What colors are they? We have blue, yellow, red, green, gray, pink, purple, brown, black, and orange. Vicky says, you need a bath, dog. When dog climbs into bed, after his bath, let's see what he looks like. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Give dog a bath. Make it him nice and clean. When he gets into bed, he has one black spot on his ear. Good night, dog. What a colorful day you've had. Yay. If you enjoyed that story, that's a fun one about dog. All right, we're ready to actually say goodbye for today. Um, we'll sing our goodbye song and then I'll play our Twinkle Twinkle on the ukulele. So we'll, let's sing goodbye friends. We can use our sign language like this. Goodbye friends, goodbye friends. Goodbye, friends, it's time to say goodbye. All right, put those hands up. And we'll get our ukulele out for some Twinkle Twinkle. Twinkle Twinkle. Wonderful day, everyone, and be safe.